I don't even know where to start. I don't want to make this video too long or too sentimental or too drawn out or just like make it. I don't even know, bro. But the thing is, a lot of people might say or a lot of people might. First of all, before I even start talking about anything, I need to thank every single person who is subscribe to me and every person who has supported me along the way and just this journey from the beginning if you just subscribed yesterday just thank you everybody who supports me genuinely and shows love and wants to see me do well and thank you just thank you so much i can't say thank you enough from the bottom of my heart i am very grateful because to be honest if we're being truthful this is not a position that a person like me should be in. When I started photography almost seven years ago, I never started it with a goal or intent to have all these people support me. I had 25 likes on a photo once, and to me that was, I like showed everybody, like bro, I got 25 likes on a photo, bro. And it's like, it's just like so much more than that. And it's always been so much more than that for me. Like I always just wanted to take photos just to, just to take photos because I loved taking photos and I loved having fun. And just along the way, there's been so many like obstacles and roadblocks and people telling me this and people trying to bring you down and just a, so many things you go through on a road to like something such as 100K. And to some people, 100K isn't even a lot. It's like, what is that to even celebrate? 100,000 people. But when you put it in perspective to how many people, 100 people is times that by a thousand, that's like that's crazy to actually think about. And where I'm from, people do not grow up to be photographers, especially a photographer with 100,000 supporters on an app like YouTube or Instagram. To be in a position and to be able to make a video saying I got 100,000 subscribers is insane to me. It doesn't even make sense. Me much, it might not be a lot, but it was such, like it was hard work getting here. Like I stopped making videos for a long time. I started making them i start started making other videos because i was like people don't like these videos and i was vlogging and making to, like it was just like what do i do like it was just a hard journey to get to this point of like a consistent work that i put out and things that i want to do and things i want people to see feel me on the block you know we got we got the whips bro for real you feel me 2017 focus Four, bitch. Hey, two door. Two door. Cool. Boom. Yeah. Who the hell Look at this nigga. Hey, I heard your niggas killing. The comparison. This nigga going through it. Hey, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, wait. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, this nigga is going through it. My overall goal is to like try to help people without a video or my photos being like this is helping you so i want people to see through what i'm doing that you can do it too i'm not the only person who comes from situations like i don't i'm not the only person who comes from a situation of violence or poverty or like a single parent household so i think that when you see someone like me make it and do things not say make it but like when you see me do things such as reach 100,000 subscribers bro like it puts it in your head that like oh I can do this too like he comes from the same place that I come from and if he can do it so can I and that's really what I want everybody to do like especially the people who are just like me my friends I I can't even call them my friends these are my brothers bro like they are literally everything to me like every bit of success is owed to them bro because without them i wouldn't be here to be completely honest every single time i had a stupid idea and i wanted to do a skit all right you can trust them i got you come on hey what's up hell yeah it looks like you got a check too bro you know what i'm saying my way to do how to contain the check bro don't forget that and I asked them to free up their time. Like, don't do nothing today because I, I, me, like this is for me. I want to do a skit or I want to do a video, bro. And they never complained. They never, they always dropped everything. They always had to do to come and help me and be there for me. And um, they never asked for anything in return. My my friends, bro, like I, like I said, I can't even call them my friends, like my brothers. They have never asked me for anything. They've never asked me to use like, who I am for their benefit or their 
own game they only want to help me like they support me like they support my dreams like it's their dreams to me you can't ask for better friends or better people to be around than the people i'm around i do a lot of work and i work hard bro but like there's a lot of things i wouldn't be able to do if i didn't have them there's a lot of things that wouldn't have happened there's a lot of things there's a lot of videos that wouldn't have happened if it wasn't for them and like uh making what I want to do for a living and my dreams a priority in their lives. So for me, I may be the face of it and y'all may know me more than y'all know my friends or anybody else, but this is because of them. So just as much as I'm deserving, they're deserving too and i support their dreams anything they want to do anything they ask me for i'm always there i'll always be there i don't ask for anything in return and these are the type of friends you need around you everybody think they can do it by themselves if you think you can do it by yourself you're wrong i thought i could do it by myself and i quickly found out that i cannot it's just like crazy to me like yesterday we had like they threw a 100k party for me and apparently they've been planning this for weeks i had zero idea bro and it was probably one of the nicest things anybody has ever done with me Does it even like this? I think y'all know probably like 20 people, right? What is this motherfucker? His ass got a hundred thousand people that don't. Michael Myers blew my shit in. But what you call it? Hit you? You already know it's where pistol game. You know, we ain't gonna stop here. To the top. I'm fucking funny. My girlfriend, Amal, she planned the whole thing. And to be honest, Amal. Once Amar came into my life, you really notice a difference when you surround and put people in your life who are genuinely there for you and genuinely want to see you happy and do anything to help you. And ever since then, like Amar, she came in and she knew I had YouTube, but like she didn't know how serious I took it. And then when I told her like, yeah, this is like what I'm trying to do, she made sure I did it. Like she put, like she dropped everything and was like, I'm going to help you, anything you need me to help you with ask me i'm here like you need me to record anything you need ideas for anything you need anything i'll learn how to edit i'll learn how to do anything develop pictures she was like i'll learn everything to help you and to be honest i love her more than anything in this world actually i know for a fact i wouldn't even be the the person i am in these videos today like she encouraged me to just be myself she encouraged me to like let all the negative shit go just be yourself who cares like if I'm ever having like an, an eternal battle about anything about like putting out a video and thinking like people might not fuck with it. like when I put out the TikTok video and people were like on my head about it she was like who cares like fuck them like be who you are don't hold your tongue for nobody don't bite your tongue for nobody and to be honest she has opened me up into being myself and on camera even though she's shy on camera and can't like really like she's like kind of timid on camera and shit she made it easier for me to be on camera and to be who i am so first of all if anybody needs to be thanked it's amal i love her to death and um i'm so happy that she's in my life and i honestly just just can't wait to keep growing with her and just everything she deserves everything in the world she's the nicest person i've ever met i've ever been around she cares about everybody else more than she cares about herself and like to me it's honestly that's a blessing and a curse because she'd be doing too much for people in my opinion but she loves everybody and she just the greatest most genuine person i've ever met to be completely honest <laughs> like she models for me she was like i don't even know how to model but i'm gonna learn or at least try to learn <laughs> 
and she was just like if you need somebody to take pictures of you can take pictures of me even though she doesn't even like giving like having her picture taken she doesn't like being on the internet she's like a real private person so like for her to do any of this is like a lot out of her but she did it all just to be able to help me bro and like you can't ask for anything more than the support that i have like none of this is possible without the support that i have bro and bro i don't, I don't even know what to say i damn near cried yesterday i did cry but ain't nobody see me cry bro i ain't gonna lie i was in that bitch crying my mom hugged me so it wouldn't nobody see me and shit but i was definitely crying bro but here let's 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 get them all in here and see if she got anything to say did you hear anything i said about you i did really yeah you want to say anything um I don't know. Maybe thank you. Everybody subscribes. Thank you, every single person. Anyway, again, thank you to everybody who has been supporting since day one, and even if you started supporting yesterday. Thank you so much, and I appreciate every single thing. It is not unappreciated at all. I'm not one of these YouTubers or people in general who act like I am bigger and better than everybody else. Everybody who has interacted with me, if you send me a DM on Instagram, I try my hardest to respond to everybody. I am not better than anybody and I try to show that all the time that I'm just a normal person who just so happened to have supporters and stuff like that. But other than that, we are all the same. We all in this together and um, yeah, just thank you to everybody. Are we gonna, are we gonna, are we gonna? Let's, let's go do some shit. <laughs> let's go do some shit, man.